If you were to tell your children one day why you're making this decision today, what would it be? Because she's perfect. Honestly. In what ways is she perfect? Everything. Yeah, I mean, every day. And I tell her that. That, that you tell her. Yeah. Je ne veux pas travailler, je ne veux pas déjeuner, je veux seulement l'oublier, et puis je fus. So it all started with Nadim's horrible salsa skills. <laughs> I was partnering with Nadim and Manal with Jazz, and um, I'm a decent dancer. I did some ballet. I can follow Nadim. I'm sorry, <laughs> not so much. I couldn't handle five minutes, <laughs> so I ended up twirling into Manal, twirled her into Nadim's hands, and I think that was spark number one. <laughs> Manal, thank you for being you. Thank you for being perfect. I am very excited for what we have ahead of us, and I can't wait. So thank you. So what don't you tell everybody? You know, you tell the person you love them. But then it becomes a commodity statement. It's like, love you, bye. Um, but I think getting the person to actually understand what that truly means is, um, is a harder message to convey. We did long distance for a long time, but it never felt like oh, this is impossible, and how am I going to manage? And I think it's a lot because we have seen our parents do it and do it so beautifully. I think I've learned that, you know, the, the love is not dependent on your circumstance. And you just need to find ways to, to make it work. And we, we did that for a, for a very long time. Good luck. Take lots of pictures, you're going to look beautiful, both of you. I haven't seen her yet, but I know she will look stunning. I pledge myself, honestly and sincerely, to be for you a loving and faithful partner. Shake it, baby, shake it. I'll let shake, baby, shake. 